Did you just do that again? Yeah. Did you just do it again? Uh, no, he was fine. Okay. Count one and two and one and two and one and two beats in each measure. One and two and one and two and one and two and one two. Remember, it's two beats in a measure and a quarter note plus one beat. These are eighth notes, so you count one and two and one and two. One and two and one, two. All right, okay. So let's do that the next time. Now let's go to our performance book. We have pages 14 and 15. Oh, the golden trumpets. This is similar. This is four beats, and this is the low G position also. One, two, and three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, two, three, four. Count, two, three, four. One, 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 two, three, four. Do the whole piece. Just do it, now it changes from B to B flat down here. But this is the same D, D, B, G. D, B, D, B, G. Left hand B, D, B, G, B, D, and hold it. And this is D, B, G. Now it's B flat. D, B flat. B flat G D B flat oh god we can't write on this B flat D B flat G B D B G D and then G this is D B and G D D D D D, 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 C sharp, D, and this is B and G. C sharp, D, D, and G. Okay, so let's see what we have. One, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four. Same thing, okay. Let's do, we'll start right here. We're going to, we'll do lines four. Five and six for next one. One, two, and three, four. that piece. Okay. Hmm. All right. This up here. Now let's go to um, accent on solo. So we have two lines. One, you count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One and two and three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One and two and three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, 
Okay. Can you do two lines? Yes. Okay. Don't play your eighth notes too fast. Start again. Okay. And I want you to finish it for next week. We'll do lines three and four. This line right here, that's the same. That's the same. So this is exactly the same as line two. This is different. Okay. So accent on solos. We'll do page 14. We'll do lines three and four. Okay. So. so Three, four, one, two, 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 three, four, one, and two, and three, four, no, slow down, three, four, one, because it's the end, so we always slow down. So you have E, G sharp, E, G sharp, E and A, E and B, one, two, three, four, the right hand has... G sharp A B B C C and then hold it one G sharp three four A. Now can you do lines three and four for next week? Yes. And finish that piece, then we can start a new one. Okay. Now let's see what we're doing with our skill book. Boy, we did all the scales. I meant almost. G sharp, we're doing all the major skills. We're working on page 32. Let's see, after C flat. I think that's the last major scale, yeah. Then we have to go back and do the minor scales. Okay, see what you can do with the uh, C flat major scale. Start again. C flat. No, that's not C flat. That's C flat is a white key. Put your thumb on C flat. D flat, E flat, that thumb on F flat, G flat, A flat, B flat, C flat, B flat, A flat, G flat, F flat, E flat, D again. C flat, D flat, E flat, F flat, G flat, A flat. B flat, C flat, B flat, A flat, G flat, F flat, B flat, D flat, last time, C flat, B flat, F flat, G flat, A flat, don't rush, C flat, B flat, A flat, G flat, F flat, B flat, B flat, C flat, good. Try the same slow progression with your left hand. Fourth finger on C flat. No, no, C flat. D flat, E flat, F flat, 4 over G flat, A flat, B flat, C flat. No, no, C flat. B flat, A flat, G flat, thumb under on F flat, D, and C flat. D flat, B flat, F flat, G flat, A flat, B flat, C flat, D flat, A flat, G flat, F flat, B flat. Last time, C flat, B flat, B flat, G flat, A flat, B flat, C flat, B flat, A flat, G flat, F flat, B flat, D flat, C flat. Very good. All right. That was good, Reyes. Now, let's go back. We haven't done the minor scales yet. So we're going to start with A minor. 
after you finish the major, we did all of these. Now I have to go back and do the minor scales. Okay, A minor has the same fingering as C major. Same fingering. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, three, two, one, three, two, one. Five, four, three, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Same thing. So the fourth finger will fall again on the seventh note of the scale, like it does in C major, but the note is different. Here it's G sharp. In C major, it's B, so you're going to notice the difference. Okay, this is the A minor scale. A, B, the notes are different. C, then C major. D, E, F, G sharp, A. Coming down, G sharp, F, E, and D, C, and B, and then we have A again. Repeat it three times. We'll put a date here. Okay, so let's see the fourth finger in the left hand, like C major, is on the second note of the scale. Of course, it's a different note. Okay, right hand starts at A below middle C. A, B, C, D, E, F, G sharp, A, G sharp, F, E, D, C sharp, B, A. Now, wait a minute, I think I wrote that wrong. One, two, three, thumb, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, thumb. Oh, no, that's right. Three, two, one. No, that's correct. C, B, ending on A. Now the left hand starts on A down here. A, B, C, D, E, third finger over F, G sharp, A, G sharp, F, E, B, C, B, A. So this is the A position. So we're playing the, the A minor scale in the A position. Right hand thumb on A, fifth finger on A, right? Do you understand that? Yes. Okay. So let's do that for next time. Okay. The scale we're learning will be A minor. And that's on page five. Okay, good. It's over here. And let's see what we have up here. Oh, they keep the Baroque preparatory level. Page 12. Promenade. That's a tough one. And we're just doing, we're doing line one line two and these two measures that's all we're doing for today so did you work on your hands alone too did you do a lot of hands alone first your right hand and then the left hand yeah i can do both okay let's see what you did okay this is real classical music okay so your right hand is in the g position and your left hand is in the um c position good fast you gotta slow that down because you're playing wrong notes it's D C B A you see the notes in that third yeah. measure D C B A okay and you also have an F sharp here it's got to be the same tempo you can't speed up here D C B A all right start again one ready one two three come with the E and these two come with the F sharp. One, one and two and three. No, you're playing wrong notes. That's, it's D, C, B, A. C, B, A, G. Take hands off. D, C, B, A, C, B, A, G. B, A, G, F sharp, G. Okay, try it one more time. Oh, we may have to do it next week. Ready, go. One, no, wrong notes. One, two, three, four. One and two and. Four. One.
section for next week. And that right hand is staccato. One, two, three, four legato. One and two and three, all legato notes. One, you gotta change the fifth finger. Then two and three and four and one and two. And then repeat it. Short, 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 short. One and two and three. Now change to five. Five, four, three, two, C, B, A, G, B, A, G, F, sharp, G. Now the left hand is staccato. E, G, D, G, staccato. G, B, now legato. E, F, sharp, G, D. Go back, repeat. E, G, D, G, C, G, B, G, legato. E, F, sharp, G. Hands together. One, two, three, four. One and two and three, four. One and two and three and four and two and four. And two and the last time you return. One, two, three, four. One and two and three, four. One and two and now you can return. All right. Do you think you can do that for next week? Yeah. If you can get these done, these four measures, that we can go on and do a new piece. Oh. What's the name of this again? Oh, that's Baroque. Page 12. And we'll say, just do section B, those four measures. Section B for next time. Good. All right, let's put this up here. And let's go to uh, Mastering the Piano. Okay, what did we do? We did Baroque. Page eight. We're going to see if we can do three lines on page eight. This is written by a classical composer, so now we have real music on this one. Page eight. The Allegro in C major by Alexander Minerville. F position, left hand, fifth finger on F. C position, high C position, right hand. One, two, one and two and one, two, count one, two, one, two. One and two and one, two, one, two, one, two, one and two and one, two, one, two, one, two, one and two and one, two, one, two. Can you do that? Yeah. Up to here. Okay. Let's see what you can do. Let's start something new. This is the. Um, I guess what do you already know right now? I think I can do that. You can do that, but when you get down here, you got to go back and play to the fine. Okay. Because this is section A, this is section B, and then you go back to A again, so it turns out to be an ABA or a three part form. Okay, let's see what you can do. See if you can pick it up right there. Ready? Go. No, wrong notes on the left hand. No, you're playing wrong notes in the left hand. Uh, did you hear what I said? Yeah. You play B and you have to play C. No, I said B. That's C. It's not B. Oh. Wait a minute. Let me sit here. 
I don't know, I made a mistake, I guess. B, C, G, everything else is correct. Everything else is right. Now, this is the only one that was wrong. That should be B and C. Sorry. Okay. Now it's corrected. Good. Now let's try it. Everyone makes mistakes. Okay. No. No, we were playing wrong notes again. It's C, F. G, F. See the G, F? Yeah. All right, start again, section B. One, there you go. Two, look, the rhythm is one, two, one and two and one, two, one and two and. Okay, try it again. One, two, one and two and one, two, one and two and one, two. No? It's G, F, I told you. You're not listening to me. Play section B again. One, two, one, ready, go. One, two, one and two and one, two, one and two and one, two, one. No, you're playing wrong notes. We may have to do it next week. We'll try it one last time. Section B. One, two, one and two. C, C, D. I don't think you played this one, have you? D, G, G, F, E, D. And the left hand is the same two notes throughout the whole piece. E and C with a first and third finger. D and G with a second and fifth finger. So you got to notice that. And these are the same throughout the entire piece. E and C. D. I'm going to give you the whole piece because I think you might be able to do it. D, G, and then E and C, and then you have a rest, silence. You don't play on the fourth beat. Okay, C, C, D, E, C, D, G, G, C, C, D, E, C, D, G, G, F, E, D, C, C, D, E, C, D, G, C, and down here is D, G, E, C, D, G, E, C, D, G, E, C, D, G, and G. The last line is just the same as the um, second line. E, C, D, G, G, F, E, D, C. C, D, E, C, D, G, C. And the bottom notes are the same. D and G, E and C, D and G. So that's still two, five. And this is still one, three. E and C, D and G, E and C, D and G, D and G. E and C, it's still 1, 3. D and G is still 2, 5. E and C, D and G. E and C. And then you have a rest on the fourth beat. Four beats in a minute. So you have to count. 1, 2, and 3, 4. 1, 2, count. 3 and 4 and 1, 2 and 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, and 3, 4. Rest.
Okay, you know the rhythm? One, two, and three, four. One, two, three, and four, and one, two, and three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, I'll give you this new piece on uh, page nine. We'll do by Cornelius Gurlitt. Fanfare, here we go. Page nine. So that means you've had one, two, three, four pieces of this book. <coughs> I'm doing fine. When we get through this book, we've got to go to level two. There's many more pieces, but it's going to be more difficult. So. But we'll see. Okay, very good. You did very well today. Very well. Your reading is getting much